I've had a chance to observe you guys. So what I'm gonna do now is I've got a physical object for each one of you to represent the challenge that's in front of you. Arlene, I have a mug for you. And the mug says, world's blank grandma. Because I don't know what to fill in. It's up to you to fill it in. I'm speechless. Ed, you are not an innocent bystander. I think your hands are equally as dirty. So I'd like you to push your sleeves up and get your hands dirty. And here we go. Can you stand up so we can see those dirty hands? There's my dirty hands. In order for this family to heal, you gotta start to step up and force these two women that you love to communicate very differently. So the last gift I have is for you, Corey. And that's a jar of leeches. Because my experience with you is that as soon as you lock onto something, you do not let go. You cannot see your culpability in any of this. And when you lock on to your position, you suck the lifeblood out of the conversation, you suck the love out of the family. Financially, you guys have leached off of Arlene, you've leached off of her for babysitting, you're you know, leeching off of Ed in some regard by not going and getting a job when things got really tough. As long as you're holding on to the way that you're doing things, there's nothing changing.